units 1 and 2 maintain current approach. We're sending out AWACS unit 82LS ahead of you on runway E29. Outside the seven mile circle. Maintain the power supply for as long as possible and keep the subways running. That's priority. But at the city center, it was the eternal battle of the blue sorrow of the mind versus the red passion of the heart. I remember. There are a few loose ends I need to take care of. So I turned around and came back. Protect me, Aka. This jerk is mine. Don't be so annoyingly arrogant, boy. You're wrong in assuming that. Just because you've managed to summon Suzaku, it means that you've won. Let me show you. This is why they call Seiryu the god of battle. We must concentrate and give Tamahome all of our life force immediately! <laughs> Miyaka, hold on to this! Send our life force to Tamahome! You have to be the one to send it to him! <laughs> Hori's gentleness. And what? Chichiri. Right. I understand. Don't let myself get lost. Chiriko's wisdom. Taski's courage. Itsukake. Thank you. I can't lose now. As long as I have your souls within me. And Miyaka, as long as I have your love with me. You stupid fool, you've lost! This is going to be easier than I thought it would be. In the end, this is all your friendship is capable of? <laughs> it's no use. He's too powerful. Miyaka! You have to stop Seiryu. Can't you seal him up somehow? That'd be tough, you know. This isn't like before when Yui sealed up Suzaku. Seiryu's already here, you know. The scroll I got from Taitsukun, it has holy power. If Miyaka can find Siryu into it, then maybe we have a chance. Siryu is just too powerful. Forget it, Chiriko! We can't ask her to do that now! 
It's true. I can heal her body, but I can't do anything about Suzaku, which is residing inside of her. With Suzaku still inside of me, if I ask for another wish to be granted, I'll be completely devoured! Chiriko, give me the scroll. us. I don't understand. Are we bad people? Say to you, Seven, this sweet child? Yes, Highness. He blasted five soldiers and his own mother to ashes in an instant. I was there. I saw it myself. Is he going to hurt me? You're safe, Highness. Ever since that moment, he's been like this. Calm. Even with all the power he has. Hmm. Such a pretty face. More like a girl, really. Very good. Clean him and bring him to me right away. Oh, how sweet. His Highness has a lovely new toy. I wonder what he'll do with him. <laughs> what are you giggling about? He is part of the legend of the you Seven, who will protect the priestess when she appears. Until then, we must take very good care of him. By that time, by the time the priest disappears... I will have complete control over my powers. And then one day... They will know me, and I will change everything. I pledge to the heavens, which have given me only hell. I shall have my revenge. Nakago. Damn you. You shouldn't go looking into another man's heart. Why didn't you dodge me? Won't you please stop? Don't humiliate me with your childish feelings. Show me some respect at least. Said you is sealed away. You have the power of Suzaku. It is stronger. And the strong win. So be it. How bitter this is. To have my dreams spoiled by a naive fool. Oh boy. Understand me. I'm happy I did it. Tamahome? I didn't lose. It's true, isn't it? I didn't lose. The beast god didn't devour me. I'm still here. Tamahome! Miyaka. 
It's over. My friends. What's going on here? Yeah, how did you all do this? It was me. It's Taitsuko! <gasps> Tamahome, still don't like my face? N no, I... <laughs> Exactly. I had the others using Nyan Nyan bodies. That way they... Taitskun's really smart, really smart. Taitskun's the lord of the stars who controls death and everything. Would you let me... I thought you really, really wanted the seven stars back with you. And the souls of the seven stars heard you. They really did. Uh-huh. They answered you really, really strongly and they came to be with Darn you. Darn it! Would you let me talk? <laughs> they never change, do they? <laughs> Very well done, Miyaka. You managed to summon Suzaku. Observe. The Kuto Empire, source of so much evil, has collapsed with the loss of its leaders. But fear not, for from this beginning it shall be rebuilt as a new nation. In Conan as well, the people are united, and it is already recovering. Hokan and Syro are also unharmed. In summoning Suzaku, and because your heart is strong and true, you have saved the world. You have fulfilled your duty as priestess of Suzaku in every way. Thank goodness. So, all that's left is to use your last wish so you two can stay together. That's right. There's still one wish left. I wonder how she should word the wish. It didn't work what Biako asked, you know. We'll never know unless she tries. How about we say we'll kick his ass unless he lets Tamahome live in this world? How can we threaten Suzaku? I'd prefer if Miyaka and I could live in this world. What are you talking about? She could bring Shoku back to life. She could fix Taitsukun's face! Hey! Ah! Maybe she could move time back to before she opened the book. What would that accomplish? Kai! Jean! <laughs> Suzaku, save this world. Return it to normal. What's she doing? It's so completely unselfish. Not only that, stupid too. Oh. What about Tamahome? And you and him and... Miyaka, are you sure? The two of you really deserve to be together. I want to thank all of you, everyone here, for caring about us. But I... I just can't. I don't think that's something I should ask Suzaku to do. All of you taught me that. Taught me just what I was capable of doing. I always thought of myself as being helpless and insignificant. Just swept along. I was always trying to please everyone else. Pulled in every direction. With my family and schools and my exams. I was wrong. Now it's different. Because even with my entrance exams, I'm going to take them from me, not because I'm being made to take them. Believing in myself, thinking of others, knowing that there are people who love me, and knowing how to love them. You taught me all that. All of you did. Nyan Nyan, I, do you mind? Can I borrow your body one more time? Because once more, I want to hold her in my arms. Noriko! That is exactly as it should be. It, it is, is not, not the, the gods, gods who make wishes, wishes come, come true. It is human feelings and emotions that do. <laughs> hey look, the book! It's flying away! My friends... I'll be praying for you. Noriko. I wish you happiness. Kutohori? It'll be all right, you know. You two will manage some sort of miracle. I know. Chichiri, Tama, Miyaka, you really think studying is boring? Not anymore, Chiriko. I'll just imagine all my textbooks were written by you. <laughs> Miyaka, a soul needs a good body to live in. Take care of yourself. Mitsukake. I will. I'll be careful. What? I'm sorry. But I don't got any farewell speech for you, so... Oh, Tusky. 
Okay, Miyaka. From now on, I won't say I don't like girls. I'll say I don't like the people I don't like. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. All of you. Thank you so much. Miyaka. Tanahome. Don't let go. Hold me tight. I will. I'll never let you go. No matter what. No, don't. Hold me. Tamahome. dangerous either of all the books I've ever read this one was the best yeah I guess you're right I'm done all right time to go for Jonan Miyaka What's gotten into you? You shouldn't push yourself so hard. <laughs> it's all right, Mom. I'll just do the best I can and see what happens after that. Don't worry about her. They say a day comes when a young girl's eyes just suddenly open, and then... Miyaka, when you read this letter, I will be gone. You and I won't be together anymore. But even if we are separated for now, I still believe that someday, someday, I will meet you again. No, I will find you again. I promise you. No matter how my appearance may change, and even if it takes thousands or tens of thousands of years, no matter what world you're in, or how far I have to travel, I will come to you again. Somehow, I know I'll reach you. And when I do, I will once again say to you, I love you. Tamahome, everyone, listen. I did it. I passed. I passed the exam. Miyaka. Yui. Why are you wandering around in a fog? You just aced the Yotsubarai High School entrance exam. Yeah. I can't believe you didn't pass yours. You're a genius, after all. <laughs> hey, even geniuses have off days. But we're not in the same class, Yui. And I was hoping we would be. I'm right next door, though. And we even have phys ed together. Isn't that... Oh, um... Yeah, it's Nakago's. It's strange, but this didn't disappear when he did. Even now, I still don't hate him. We were so much alike. He and I... He existed inside of me. That's why I never want to forget his mistakes. It hurts, but I can learn from him and all the things he did. Uh -huh. I think you're right. He existed inside of me, too, and all the others. Yeah, they live inside our hearts forever, I hope. And I feel I know my own heart better now. Yes, 
They will all live on in the young girl's hearts. As well as in the heart of this handsome young romantic hero. Why are you suddenly butting in to play the narrator, huh? <laughs> Tetsu is waiting for me up ahead. Come on, I'll buy you lunch. Wow. This has really made me think about how there's still hope for this world. You see, this spring, we had a kind of strange new guy transfer into our school. The really interesting thing is, this guy had memories and dreams of a past life ever since he was a little kid. In this past life, he was charged by destiny to protect a young girl, a priestess. He says he was one of seven people charged to protect her, but he alone made a promise to her before they were separated. That no matter what, no matter how far he had to travel, and even if it took thousands and thousands of years to do it, that he would find her again. At last. At long last. I've found you.